was the top news headlines. 37 Air India flight passengers with Manipur's second COVID-19 case identified. Bimi Ningomam tested negative. India's COVID-19 cases go up to 3,000, largely driven by Tablighi Jamaat attendees. And 800 plus foreign Jamaat workers found hiding in Delhi mocks. Hello and good evening. Welcome to Times of Manipur. This is Hari Priya Tongram giving you the news in details. Altogether, 37 people who had travelled in an Air India flight from Delhi to Imphal on March 11, along with the state's second COVID-19 case, have been identified, and that that have been kept under quarantine. Official sources inform today. These people, including 14 women, are considered as high risk as they were in close proximity with the 65 years old man. According to the spokesperson of the state medical directorate, sample of 16 people from the Peace Hospital and Research Institute, Porompat, where the patient was treated earlier, have been sent to Jenim's forties. Meanwhile, samples for 12 family members of the patient tested negative today. Notably, after a 23 years old woman from Thangmaiban in Imphal was tested positive for COVID-19 last month, the 65 years old man from Lelong in Thaubal district with the travel history to Nizamuddin in Delhi was tested positive for COVID-19 on April 2. Meanwhile, the first COVID-19 positive patient of Manipur, Bimi Ningombam, has tested negative today. Medical superintendent of Jenim's Dr. T. Razan has confirmed to Tom TV that the result of Bimi has been tested negative. During a telephonic conversation with Tom TV editor Jit Ningomba, Dr. T. Razan said that a confirmatory test will be conducted on April 6. Speaking about the people from Manipur who recently attended Nijamuddin event, Dr. T. Razan said that one of the samples from the group was sent to the National Institute of Virology, Pune, and it was been tested negative. Dr. T. Razan added that Bimi will be kept in observation for a month in isolation. Uh, social media da keno si bimi si negative oi de na la pa du kana puk sungi basi bo ma ga si de sore oi du ma ji ko si khatin su ba ta bo de so ye ma ji ma si la pa du khatin su de ma ga le na bi ni pa ga ma 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 ka na si a du ma ji su ma ji de ti bo re a ka me dri ke sama ai ji ma ji ผู้ที่เกี่ยวกับการดูเอ่อสําหรับมันเดียร์อะไรสิอะไรที่ชื่อว่าอืมไอ้ยังที่ทํามาจะกับผู้ว่าจะมาดูว่าอันเป็นเ
The number of COVID-19 cases in the country climbed to 2,902, while the toll rose to 68, according to the Union Health Ministry. The number of active COVID-19 cases stands at 2,650, while 183 people were on the and one had migrated to another country, it said. As per media reports, the highest number of confirmed cases of the pandemic was reported from Arastra at 423, followed by Tamil Nadu with 411 infections. The number of cases in Delhi has gone up to 386, in Kerala to 295, in Rajasthan to 179, and in Uttarakhand and in Uttar Pradesh to 174. In Andhra Pradesh, cases have increased to 161, while Telangana has 158 positive patients so far. The number of cases has risen to 63 in West Bengal. Punjab has reported 53 cases of COVID-19 so far, followed by Haryana with 49 cases. Bihar has 29, Assam has 24, Chandigarh 18, Uttarakhand 16 and Ladakh has reported 14 cases so far. Jharkhan and Manipur have reported two cases each, while Mizoram and Arunachal Pradesh have reported a case each. Early this week, security establishment and health workers came close to completing the evacuation of 2,300 people from the Tablighi Jamaat headquarters in central Delhi's Investigations led by the police to conclude that there were more foreigners staying in different mocks in the national capital. On 31 March, the Delhi police sent an urgent message to the Delhi government. It was to seek help to locate the remaining Jamaat workers out of the city's mocks. The police communication listed 16 mocks. Investigators were prepared to find 187 foreigners and two dozen Indian nationals who had shifted to the mosque after attending congregation meetings at the headquarters of the religious sect in Delhi's Nijamuddin area. It turns out they were horribly wrong. All Manipur United Clubs organization Amoko has called on the Manipur government to take appropriate steps to ensure there is no dirt of 
life-saving drugs and food for domesticated animals during the nationwide COVID-19 lockdown. Amuko said the people living with HIV and those who are suffering from cancer, diabetes, liver and kidney patients have started feeling uneasy now due to the lockdown and curfew. Cancer patient, whatever, diabetes, colon, lady bar, blood pressure, lady bar, heart, nava, kidney, nava, amadi, liver, nava, asumba, anava, singa, sina, makoi, ne normal sina river, normal sariba, ida, and fixing a door, madu, lupuidra, hagagi, makoi, the singa, nanga, ma, hob of nove, madam duna, masuba, miamna, madu, and anava, singa, singa, riba, ida, and we drag, singa, riba, say, for never, but if you go in a honey view, aduga, a koi, minula, in a piecing now. The mid Kudigi Sariba, Hidak and Texing, Amadi, Hayam, Makoida, Delivery, Batamda, Changa the Vidal and Texing as issue, Wat the Nova Mangjuna, Gomena, Apoi, Packet Paper, Tabaxin Packet View Haina, Amukogi, my Kedi, a field of Jedi. Now let's have a short commercial break. Do stay tuned for more updates. Kanganjaba. Lamzingba Hospital and Medical Research Institute Private Limited na Housik Oiba Kudong Chadaba Kayasigi Yenglaga Miam Gitamak Hospital Asigi Maternity Ward Pum Kunmari Hangduna Miam Gitogal Tojagani Adumakpu Hospital Asigi Atopa Department Singhi Service Lepchagani Hospital Asida Lakchangi Mamanda Makada Pijariba Contact Number Asida Han Appointment Lobiu Amadi patient ka miyoy amadigi hena loy na bilakta na ba kanganjari. Kanganjari ba Lamjingba Hospital and Medical Research Institute Private Limited, Rims South Gate, Kombire Kaitel. Contact number 82589678901. Sangai Services Private Limited, Yellow Mida Thabak Piracy. Thabak ta chilao thiroi si. Ado madom na mayok nari ba awaba singa du kokhan na bagi damak laizare. Sangai Services Private Limited. Yum gimi yam na leje de hai bagi obi ganu. Yum gimi darkar oiba thabak thoram sing tobi na bas sinhe pagi khudong chaba kungi gani. Manipur da ahan bo oina yam na hong na amadi yam na line phone call amakha darkar oiba sinmi nek pa yabagi khudong chaba pijari ba Sangai Services Private Limited ne. Pung kharagi amadi nong magi wai bagi khudong chaba su pijari. Pijari ba service sing di any type of construction, driver and home tutor available, housekeeping and house cleaning, pest control, catering service. Electrician, carpenter, bar, electronic repairing, hybrid, fridge, AC, water purifier, asina chingbasing, semjadi, amadi, any type of labors available. Akupamural gidama contact tobiu, Sangai Services Private Limited, Uripok Torang Mamlekai, Manipur 795001. Aikogi contact number 7005071707 Natraga, 7005112624. I could email ID Sangai Services at gmail.com. Welcome back. 16 members of Yening Tantha Band distributed 50 kgs rice and rupees 1000 each to 60, 36 poor families of Kumbi under Thanga and Moirang constituencies during the COVID 19. Program arranger of the band Moirang Thim Abung Maite said that. The money distributed today was from different programs the band attended last year. One of the recipients flies from Obi Devi lauded the efforts of the band and wish them good luck in their future endeavors. <laughs> Kakching police today detained 60 vehicles and fined for violating curfew and lockdown. Kakching district police led by officer in charge detained the vehicles at Kakching Kongnangmari Pangba. The vehicles on were produced before the district magistrate and fined rupees 200 each. They were later released after giving the strict instruction. Nambol police today arrested 18 persons along with 10 vehicles for violating curfew along National Highway 150 Tidim Road. They were produced before the sub district magistrate Nambol and a fine rupees 200 each. A team of Manipuri diaspora in Bangalore today distributed food items to Manipuris in the city during the COVID-19 nationwide lockdown. Manipur PHED Minister Alok 
Ostidiko today chair a meeting at Ukru Mini Secretariat to discuss COVID-19 outbreak and measures taken up by the government to combat the virus. Other officials also attended the meeting. International Human Rights Organization Manipur President Oinam Jotin distributed hand sanitizer, masks and hand gloves to the additional superintendent Operation Mori Police M. Amit. Jotin added that they will continue to help further. Youths of Iting Kunjao led by Thangapa to Pradhan Ning Thousan, Chandra and Ward number one member Moirang Thim Kunja Bihari sanitized the surroundings of Iting Kunjao with disinfectants. The residents were told not to venture out during the lockdown and curfew. Amid the nationwide lockdown to combat the outbreak of COVID-19, a forest area measuring about 400 acres was set on fire in Churachanpur by some unknown person suspected to be hunters. The incident took place at Swada, Swangdo village located along Gwaiti Road National Highway 102B, which is about 65 kilometers south of Churachanpur district headquarters, a report said. Pausang Thang, secretary of Shuangdo village authority said the white wildfire started on the evening of March 28 at four different places, Jaupi, Bualtang, Lokhangtang and Le Maljuangtang. The fire was quelled, on, quelled only by rain in the evening of 2nd April. The village authority appealed to the district administration to initiate an investigation into the incident and book the culprit as per the laws of the lane. A house was completely destroyed in a major fire at Ulaumaya Ileka under Nambol police station at Bishnupur district last night around 6. The house belongs to one Loitongbam Danachandra is 70 years. The cause of the fire was unknown. One LPG cylinder was also exploded during the fire. Properties worth over rupees 20 lakh were destroyed in the blast, sources said. A team of Bishnupur police led by Superintendent of Police Priya Darshini Laishram, fire tenders of Imphal and Bishnupur prevented the fire from spreading to neighboring houses. ASP Priya Darshini Laishram handed over rupees 5,000 to the house fire victim family as immediate relief. And now let's have another short commercial break. Do stay tuned. Hidak oina amadi thau oina animak sizi nava yaraba sangbrai thau fangbiragani. Sangbrai pambiragi sungba organic oiraba amadi side effect laitraba thau asina. Hiram kayada kanava piri. Nungsang, laikoi, haksang sikpa, laihau, apomba, puri, sam kenba, tonsil na chingba kaya laying bada kanava piri. Thau sitak padiyade. Akupomor gidama contact tobiu. Sangbrai thau kiam gay maning laikai. Contact number 9366949811. Welcome back. Social Development Club SDC Life from Kuno Maka Lekai in Imphal is in association with Life from Kuno Maka Lekai Gram Panchayat member Samurai Lapam Somorjit Sarma. Volunteers of Lekai Gi Singlup, local clubs, and Mera Pai B distributed edible items to more than 250 households at Life from Kuno Maka Lekai today. Refuting the allegations labelled by Jiribam Municipal Council Chairperson S. Santi Devi against Jiribam MLA Mohammed Asab Udin over distribution of rice to Jiribam residents in an unfair manner, nominee of the local MLA M. Promen told journalists at Jiri News Network office today that these allegations are baseless and unfounded. 
Manipur Governor Dr. Najma Haftullah has extended greetings to the people of Manipur, especially to Jane Breden on the sacred and auspicious occasion of Mahabir Jainty 2020. Lord Mahabira and Apostle of Peace and Nonviolence, so humanity, the path to salvation through love, compassion, mercy and abdication of material elements, the governor stated in her message. Tom TV has started a new program, Your Voice, Adomgi Konjal. Please express your grievances and issues through our channel. Send audio or video to our WhatsApp number 9402491494 or 8415875251 or 8413956065961292875 or 8119080500 along with a copy of your Aadhaar card. Please mention your name and address properly. Be a citizen journalist to bring a change in the state. Get ready to be the first citizen journalist. Prasanna Yamna Thawayauna Akoi Gi Imunga Mada Nungai Tava Thopa Kudung Sadava Thopa Ada Gi Laina Layong Thorpa Matam Sida Yam Collective Humanity Ama Utlaga Yam Depressive Oiba Matam Sida Akoi Gi Minung Si Hai Vazi Kari No Compassion Ama Utlaga Mating Ama Ama Mating Pang Na Bagi Mining Ama Thokha Laga Taurak Pase Asi Aina Sarkar Gi Mai Kaida Gi Sukha Uhanja Ningi Aduga Aina Hana Hana Akoi Gi Pabung Siem Enbirian Dazu Hana Hana Epil Taujari Sarkar Nasu Akoi Gi Chief Minister Gi Haksel Tengbang Gi Skim Ada Gi Relief Fund Lai Riba Sing Sida Gi Karakai Thukpi Raga Akoi Gi Olivia Goy Family Gi Ada Gi Ma Gi Laiyang Gi Treatment Mayam Sida Mateng Kera Pang Bira Gadi Yamna Nungai Jagani Aduga Makoi Gi Imung Nasu Ado Gi Gratitude Tu Soi Duna Ud Bira Gani Aduga Punsi Gi Kao Zeroi Hai Bado Ai Hai Jage Ay hauji hauji ko hati the self quarantine do do na yum jale jari COVID-19 sinam mara mo do na 21 days lockdown lao thoki ba amade flight amade transportation atay mayam thing jalak pa dagi yum da jo matam chana thoka utre hauji ko hati the grocery dukan vegetable dukan amata hang na dre paisa le raga jo poche am ta fang dre COVID-19 gi positive case no no magi hendil lak le asam amade notice atay state da jo Asi na maro mo'y doon na lockdown gino mo'y doon extend tawra o'y hainin ay laite. Extend tawra o'y pagi chan su yam wangye. Ado na Manipur Sarkar gi may kay da gizu ang amba mating pang biyo yaraga di evacuate to biyo yung da Manipur da. Total lockdown da gi hei na kanjalak pa na maro mo'y rakan da. Chat thok khotok pa yarak ta ba polis ki mating law na po honarak pa da su Mapan dah, aku ini thok pengam dah ba. Polis na tanjan ba. Amadi mafam khara dah Delhi gi, mafam khara dah angang sing dah. Hari ini student sing dah, no iski student sing dah. Cing kilo ahum dah gi he na pirak taba. Adi yumbu sing na Delhi kerajaan na lak thok cara gasu. Tha aw ani gi free oi gada bani hari gasu. Yumbu sing na pasah thorok pa. Amadi pi pengam dah ba dah gi tan thorok pa kaya amasu hauji yau re. What member of what number 22 of Imphal Municipal Corporations I belong to the hot cities of Imphal Town, namely Minithong Hatta Golapati. Our state government providing food, shelter, and needy items to people who are coming from different states and staying in my world. Likewise, 
I request the central government, different state government, chief minister, ministers, councillor, what member, NGOs, and to my loving people of our country, that some of our Manipuri brother and sisters staying in your state, they need food, shelter. This is my humble request. Please provide the necessary assistance so that they can survive and can fight Corona. Sana Taknaba, Amagi, Amagi, Loy, and Maxumay, and the Tauta, Manipur Sakarna, Sana Taknab, the Kitang Mating Pangbiri, Adubo, Munu, Mujang, Chang, the Bayatra, I could give my problem. My yard to take empty Taubiadaba, and on my Giritas, my Giritas, Lucella Paris, as Ting or Tiri Pangsilataba, Local Gikai, Dama, Madame Magi, Magi Tang, Niteki, Kapia, Basu, my Magi County, Pesalo, Silacomara, Morega, Akoi Hosek. My Gitas, Kana, I am Kana Mayuknari, my Gitas Ponta, the main member, the Yankan Mayuknari, Adon Manipur Sakana, a quick make a credit to Hanel Pasani Ler, Mania, the Deki Kitang, Hangat Piraga, credit to Kitang, Hangat Pigera, and a Traga Topalitum, Simbira Kera, Masim Tanga, Manipur Sakagi, Punin Jin Sensari, Masim Tang Taubira de Yam Nangani and Kali. And now let's have the further details. A total of 338 inmates in have been released from jail in Mizoram in a bid to reduce the risk of coronavirus transmission in overcrowded detention facilities. According to reports, the Information and Public Relations Department in a statement said that the prisoners were released according to the decision of the higher High Power Committee headed by Gawahati High Court Judge Michael Jothankuma, which was formed on the Supreme Court's direct. The government released 48 convicts and 290 trial prisoners. Altogether, 338 from various jails across the state by granting them remission, the statement said. All deputy commissioners and superintendents of police of the districts were instructed to drop the prisoners at their homes. The Supreme Court on March 23 directed all states and union territories to constitute high-level committees to consider releasing on parole on interim bail prisoners and under trials for offences and telling up to seven years jail term to decongest prisons in the wake of coronavirus pandemic. The Northeastern Regional Agricultural Marketing Corporation Limited Neramek has inducted Manoj Kumar Das into its helps at a time when enterprising fraternity in the Northeastern region in having a tough time. Das joined as managing director in the central public sector enterprise in addition to his current assignment in the Northeastern Development Finance Corporation Limited, NETFI, as deputy general manager. Alia Das served as the director of Indian Institute of Entrepreneurship, IIE, Guwahati for close to three and a half years. Neramek hopes same temperament in Das to be back on tracks. Major Biotech Com company Bharat Biotech is working on the development and testing of a vaccine against COVID-19. The vaccine called Coroflu is being developed in partnership with University of Wisconsin Medicine and US-based company Flugen. The vaccine which is currently in the animal testing phase in the US is expected to be ready for human trials within, within the next three months. The Coroflu vaccine will be manufactured on the basis of Flugen's flu vaccine candidate known as AIM-2-SR. Based on an invention by the University of Wisconsin Medicine, Virologies and Flugen on co-founders Yoshihiro Kwaka and Gabriel Newman. M2SR is a self-limiting version of the influenza virus that induces an immune response against the flu. Kaoka's leaf will insert gene sequences from SARS-CoV-2, which causes COVID-19 into M2SR, so that the new vaccine will also induce immunity against the coronavirus. Varad Biotech in Hyderabad will then begin production scale up for safety and efficacy testing in humans. Corona flu could be in human clinical trials by October, media reports said. 
President Donald Trump says his administration is encouraging many Americans to wear face masks in public, though he stresses that the recommendation is optional and is conceding that he will not comply with it, a media report said. The Trump administration expected new guidance that many people in the United States should start wearing face covering when out in public is raising concern that it could cause a sudden run on masks. Though some people already have begun acquiring or creating face masks on their own, the administration's new guidance could taste the market's ability to accommodate a surge in demand. It was expected to be limited to people in areas of the country hit hard by the coronavirus, not nationwide, as some health experts had urged. The new guidelines to be announced Friday will encourage people to use more rudimentary covering like T-shirt, bandanas and non-medical masks. And President Donald Trump himself suggested scarves could be a good alternative to masks. Before we close, let's see the top news headlines once again. Air India flight passengers with Manipur's second COVID-19 case identified Bimini Ombam tested negative. India's COVID-19 cases go up to 3,000, largely driven by Tablighi Jamaat attendees. Eight hundred plus foreign Jamaat workers found hiding in Delhi mocks. That's all for the moment. Thank you very much for joining us. Keep watching Times of Manipur News update and good night.